the Sony building in Ginza, Tokyo. Always crowded with many Japanese and visitors from all over the world, enjoying themselves operating and handling various Sony products. Now, let's review some of the highlights in our pioneering product development efforts. Sony put on the market the first tape recorder in Japan in 1950, the first transistor radio in Japan in 1955, the world's first transistor TV set in 1960, the 5-inch micro TV set in 1962, and the world's first all-transistor portable video coda in 1963. The Trinitron color TV developed in 1968 one of our most important technical breakthroughs in recent years. Trinitron system can produce brighter and sharper pictures than the conventional sets and has set a new standard for color TV picture quality. The path we trod was indeed that of a pioneer, always devoted to opening up new technological possibilities. Here at the research center, Sony's scientists are at work to develop the company's advanced technology which should always be in the lead. This is the Sony head office and Shinaga plant in Tokyo. Here, Sony transistor radios and cassette tape recorders are manufactured. Sony's Trinitron TV assembly factories. This is a Trinitron TV picture tube factory. And a Sony electronic tube factory. Sony's Trinitron assembly factory. Transistor TV sets are being manufactured here at the Color TV factory in Tokyo. Trinitron Color TV Assembly Factory in central Japan mass produces Trinitron Color TV sets. Here, the most modern facilities and the newest techniques combine to turn out Sony products of unique high quality. At this factory, also in central Japan, Trinitron color TV picture tubes are being manufactured. About 35 miles southwest of Tokyo is a semiconductor factory where transistors and diodes, the heart of Sony products, are being mass produced. This plant, about 250 miles north of Tokyo, produces high quality audio and video magnetic recording tapes. The plant is also developing and manufacturing ferrite cores 
which are of vital importance as transistor radio and TV parts. has a machine shop of its own to produce the parts needed for its new products and also to design and produce production facilities. This machine shop plays a very important role for Sony, the pathfinder. At another plant in Tokyo, Faded lines of audio equipment are being mass-produced. is also equipped with facilities for manufacturing the video coda, a product which is of prime importance in the electronics industry. The work at assembly lines is efficiently carried out with superb team spirit. At each working place, the leader's plans and instructions are promptly and smoothly conveyed to each member there and carried out precisely as intended. Sony attaches great importance to technology, but it values people even more highly. Trying to bring out the best in the individual, the company assists its employees in developing their personnel potentialities to the fullest. This is based on its firm belief that high product quality is the outcome of employees' fully motivated work at the production line. Here is another technological landmark achieved by Sony's research and development staff. The Sony Color Video Cassette System. After stirring up a VTR craze all over the world, with the development of the compact VTR, another world's first, Sony has developed the video cassette as a prime product of the future, comparable to the color TV of today. Sony's proven superiority in audio technology it's video technology that has produced the Trinitron and its excellent all-round research and development staff with great enthusiasm for product development have all combined to produce the video cassette system, opening up a wholly new vista in color video technology. 